Hey, what's happening guys this is Shukesh once again and today I'm gonna review one of the best e-signature platforms it's from Wondershare and it's called eSign Plus which is I think a great alternative to DocuSign or Adobe Acrobat and there are actually a couple of new features added to this eSign Plus 2.3.0 before I explain all these features to you, let me tell you, there is a great sale going on. You can avail 90% discount. That is for one year, you will have to pay just under $10, which is really very, very cheap. Check the description of this video for the direct link. You can also buy one month subscription for just 99 cents. You can of course try free of cost with limited functionality. I will give you a quick demo of this e-signature platform. It's extremely fast, easy and very reliable and it works on any platform whether it's Windows, Mac or iOS. You can send files to multiple people to collect signatures and this also supports multi-user platform. Now after you purchase, visit the eSign Plus website and login. Check the description of this video for the direct login link. If you are logging for the first time, then you need to sign up with your email ID and your first name, your last name, which will be used for all the communications. Now since I already have a premium account, let's log in with my email address and the password. So this is the user interface of eSign Plus, which is very, very easy and intuitive. To send out documents for collecting signatures, you can start by clicking on this button. Then upload the PDF from your computer. After uploading, you can view the PDF document to make sure it is the correct file. Now there is an added feature which is not available in the free trial mode. You can add an access code if you want to make this process more secure of course. Next it's time for adding the signer's email addresses. So type in the email address of all the people you want to send out the files to. Now if you need to sign the document yourself, there is an option for that and it's the most interesting part. By default, the signers will sign the document in the order they are entered here and if you select sign first, then you need to sign the document before others. Only after you sign, they will get the mails. You can actually put your logo, your face, and also you can add a short message with the access code you want. Now it's time for placing the fields of the signature or the initials date of the signing which is automatic and you can even create custom fields if you want. Now select the next signer and put the fields as you wish. You can of course resize, reposition or remove the fields. Well, we are set, so let's click on the next button and the file has been sent out to the recipients for signing. Now since I have to sign the document myself, let's try that. I can do this here, no need to go to my mail address. Now there are three ways to sign, I can type, I can upload my signature or I can even draw here. This is the first time I am creating my signature, uh, next time it will be automatic. I can change the color of the signature of course. So there you go, it has been created and let's click on date to add the date, submit signature. So this is how I have signed the document and it has been sent out to other signers. So this is the email other recipients will get. So scroll down and click on sign the document. The procedure is same but of course you need the access code first. Then you can sign the documents in any of the three ways I have shown you. My signature is already on the file. So this is how eSign Plus works. It's extremely fast, easy and very very user friendly. Of course recipients don't need any eSign Plus account to sign the document. Alternatively you can bulk send a single document to multiple recipients and if you wish, you can also create templates which you can apply to multiple documents. This will save you time for multiple files. Now what I like most about eSign Plus is you can check your documents in real time that is the status, who have signed, who have viewed the document, which one is complete. You can send reminders and to download the documents whether they are complete or not, you can just click and click on download. 
you can individually check which recipient signed the document who have viewed it so indeed is sign plus is a very capable service check the description below for the direct link if you want to try this out and once again there is a great sale going on so this is your chance to get wondershare is sign plus at such a low price thanks a lot guys for watching this video this is shukesh signing off have a nice day